Stella Weaver, how talented she is. The 22nd girl, they got Stella Weaver. They're Stella and the fellas. That's what this team has been rolling into the World Series. Now, I think by the end of this tournament, maybe the entire country will have Weaver fever. This one to right field. Another good play here, Stella Weaver. She ranges to her right to make the play. This is the kind of action you like at the Little League World Series. Pitches, balls in play, good defense. Off speed, hit hard on the ground. That's fielded by McShane. From his knees, she is safe. Great hustle from Stella Weaver to beat it out. That was hit hard, and McShane at short did everything he could, but she looked determined to get a hit. This ball was smoked. And how about Brady McShane, the shortstop, making the play from his knee, trying to throw her out. Stella wasn't going to have it. That five foot eight, all the legs getting down the line. Watch her get after it, put the head down, pretty much reach, then fall to get herself a base hit. Tabor, this one is shallow left field. That's going to get down. Weaver is being waved. Here she comes. Oh, the coach knew it. There was no chance to get her when she made her stay mind it, up and it, give the it, third base it. coach all the credit in the world. Charlemagne threw it in and they caught them by surprise. Weaver's wheels the difference for the seventh run. And she paused because she didn't know if this ball was going to be caught. So you watch her turn around, get herself into position. She pauses there and this is just the speed. Look at her kick it to another gear to come home. And Rob, you're right. Because she had paused, it looked like she was going to hold up at third, but no way the speed of Stella Weaver. Getting another run for Tennessee. How about this moment? <laughs> Getting that to be able to talk to Bryce Harper. That's a keepsake. This is history. We're watching the seventh time in Little League Baseball World Series history that we're going to see a female take the mound. And you guys, she's not just a girl, she's a ball player. You see her signing autographs there. With so Nolan Chang will lead things off. Good pitch, Weaver with a strikeout of Chang. She went back to the fastball. So if I were to go back, it'd be a lot of what Stella Weaver's got, and that's confidence. Being able to instill this into a young girl, and Stella, the way that she commanded this strike zone, this at bat, the breaking ball, but then comes back with the fastball, blows it by some quick hands of Nolan Chang. Sydney Crosby, her favorite player. Right up the middle, she delivers a hard hit. Runner at third being held. Stella Weaver, line shot, first and third. She smoked this. This ball, too, she stays with it. You watch the break on this. Head, eyes down. Mm. And that's why she absolutely drives you. Talk about her playing hockey. That looked like a hockey stick, getting through the lower part of the zone, driving this one right up the middle. She hit it so hard, McCarty had no chance to score. Third baseman in. Ball. They have scouted Trey very well. Weaver goes on the throw to the pitcher, and she's in there safely at second. And what great base running that is. Now the double play is not in order. Stella, <laughs> she can throw a baseball, she can hit a baseball, and she can run. Forget about it. <laughs> Stella Weaver, by the way, Julie, just delivered a hit. Your girl, Stella. Stella, she wants some pizza as well. And now she is the first female U.S. player to get three hits here at the Little League World Series. First one. We're over that 65 pitch threshold. That one is into right field. Stella, watch her run to third. On the back, Easily makes it. And back-to-back -back hits, Weaver and Gideon Shepler, first and third, another threat for Tennessee. Stella on Weaver, back, no doubt back, about it. Back, she, ease. she gets around these bases. He went down and got that ball. How could Stella Weaver be the tallest kid on the team and one of the fastest? That one does get by. Here she comes. Stella Weaver is in. Weaver's wheels make a big difference. 2-0 Tennessee. Manufacture yourself a run. You get on base, two outs, single going opposite field. You go first to third, and then the reacts. Just being able to understand this ball gets away. It's about nine steps home when you're five foot eight, got the legs of Stella Weaver. Stella, we're starting with you. You're setting records left and right. You're the first female in the United States to get three hits in the Little League World Series. Seventh female on the mound. What has all of this experience been like for you? 
it's been crazy being here, being with this team, being with our coach. But me and Coach Randy also made a bucket list, which was getting the most hits at, for in the U.S. for girls and getting the most hits out of the whole tournament and, like, playing different positions that other girls haven't played. But it's been, like, really fun. We've did that bucket list. We've gotten one down. So yeah, I was just going to say, one down. Here we go. For every young girl and boy watching out there, what do you want them to know when they see you play? Um... Feed off the good energy from me, uh, watch what I do, and just have as much fun. Just if you, play soft, if you play baseball and you're a girl, then just have as much fun as you can and believe in yourself. Ooh, hit that one hard, that's up the middle. That's where Stella Weaver hits it and she turned it around. Another hit, her fourth at the Little League World Series. Tied for the most hits ever now, it doesn't matter, U.S. International, Stella Weaver, and this one explosive.